About a month from the return of Orange Crush to Tybee Island, it's an event that the city officials say brought about 40,000 people last year. Our Anna Stansfield spoke with the mayor today and joins us now live from the newsroom. Anna, what are they doing to get ready? That event is scheduled to hit the island the weekend of April 19th, something Tybee's mayor tells me they are already planning for. City officials say with the number of people packing the island for last year's unpermitted event, there were massive backups on the roads, both coming in and leaving the island. They also say it put an extra burden on local law enforcement and resources. This year, Mayor Brian West says one thing they are focusing on is that traffic. He says they're looking at ways to control parking and make sure cars keep moving along the roadways. This all comes as a bill is currently awaiting Governor Kemp's signature that would allow municipalities to hold organizers of unpermitted events like Orange Crush financially accountable for any damages caused. We have reached out to the governor to um, make sure that, uh, you know, that that is still on his desk and um, we know that's still under consideration. Um, it's very busy in his office right now. There's a lot of legislation going through um, that he, you know, that he has to uh, you know, consider for for his signature. We're confident that it is going to go through in time uh, for this event. Now that bill has been on his desk since about two weeks ago and we will continue to track its progress and keep you updated as anything changes. For now, live in the newsroom, Anna Stansfield, WTOC News.